to a day in our life. This is the show where you get a little bit of everything. This is another episode of the Wonder Bill Show. The Wonder Bill Show. All right, so hey, I'm back in an RV. This has been a what, two months or so, uh, just being completely out of this thing, not living in it or even near it uh, for a while, a month and a half at least. And so what I'm doing, I had to actually come back and don't judge me on this. <laughs> I had to come back and fix this piece right here. And so that little valve that whenever you press down on this guy, it actually flushes without leaking, which is what it was doing constantly before. And it was leaking from this upper tube right here because this seal was not good enough. So what I did is I got some wire and I really just closed it off basically. Like there's no, like I even put a little bit of the like sealant around here as well. And this is actually a new piece. This was not leaking at all. Either way, it's working fine now. Everything's back to normal as far as after that freeze that we had. I mean, except for needing to clean everything. Uh, and this has been off. I completely turned it off. We have no gas running through this thing even. So I just was like, oh, we're just going to completely shut it off and defrost it. So I found a bunch of, uh, like a light amount of mold, which I know Blair's not here right now and she's going to love here and that <laughs> so um i've sprayed it with clorox bleach it'll be fine by like a couple hours um that'll be cleaned out uh then i'm just gonna dust everything and then slowly disinfect as i go and uh i should be done within probably i give myself two hours probably two hours and it'll be clean enough to put a child in which is what we're planning on doing so i'm gonna start just kind of organizing some things making some room Ooh, got some wipes. Like I said, should be done in about two hours. I'll show you briefly what I'm doing. I was gonna show you all the toilet, but it's just been it's been a fix that's just been I tried one thing and it didn't work. I tried another thing and it didn't work and so so on. So I finally got this piece and I was like, I bet this isn't even gonna work. And so I like I put everything into it. I even cut myself a little bit. So that was great. Cool. Let's get this thing cleaned up and hopefully move back in to by this weekend. Today's Thursday. I don't even know what day it is. We'll figure ourselves out later. So here's the fridge. As you can see, this is actually, I didn't want to show y'all before, but this was uh, kind of dark. <laughs> up in there, up in there. That and that. This one still has some stuff. But uh, yeah, it's the power of bleach right there. So I'm gonna clean all this out, just wipe everything, and then go back over it with just kind of like a like a soapy rinse, and then, uh, yeah, turn that guy back on. And then on to everything else that I have to clean, which I pulled the sheets off, and I still need to clean the whole area up here. But, I mean, I'm getting there. I'm not cleaning everything with bleach, just because, uh, I don't know, it's very potent. But I do have some other cleaners that I'm gonna go through everything with, and I've dusted everything. I didn't film that. I didn't think y'all would want to see me just dusting things. So, there you go. You're welcome. Why would you look outside yourself when you have all of the world inside? One, two, three, four. Yeah, your heart is the sun and it shines as it opens Where well, your heart is the sun and it shines as it opens Yeah, your heart is the sun and it shines That's how it opens Yeah, you don't, know, you ever you get these? You look cute I think it's my age <laughs> It's like dental foundation It's like, it's a car Like I have one Here, open your clothes Oh, wake up Oh, we recycle. Hey! Who is that, Eva? Is that you? Uh, say, Eva. Where's Eva's nose? 
She's pointing. <laughs> Nose. Nose. Yeah. Yeah. Good job. Where's Eva's chin? Yeah. Oh, there's your yeah. chin. Where's Eva's neck? Neck. We can't see it. We can't see it. There it is. Where's yeah. your eyes? Careful. Okay. Don't poke. Yeah. Oh yeah. Don't poke your eyes. Where's your eyebrows? Eyebrows. Where's yours? She's trying to move them. Oh yeah. Where's your ears? Where's your belly? <laughs> Where's your hair? Yeah. That's so pretty. Where's your arm? Yeah, That's what about good. your fingers? Fingers. Fingers, yeah. <laughs> Cheeks. <gasps> When something hurts, you good want them to be able to show you. Show me. Mm -hmm. So I just got back from the gym. I had a really, really good workout, and I miss our gym so much because it's like my second home. But I walked in, and Matt seems to have done a really great job of cleaning. I can tell the floors are completely clean. Eva's little corner is all cleaned up. Bathroom, completely clean. Everything looks great. Tested out the toilet, toilet works. I mean, it looks like it's ready for us to move back in. So, we will be back in the RV soon. We'll see how it goes with Eva. We're just gonna have to spend a lot of time outside, which is fine, because she loves it outside. It's just getting hot real fast. But, we're gonna be so close to the house. Every time we see anybody getting stuff over there, done, done over there, we're probably gonna head over and pester them to get more done. Which I don't know if that'll have the opposite effect. But we're just ready to be back in our, just, we love it here. Y'all know how much we love it here. It's just, I mean, look at outside. It's gorgeous. It is gorgeous out here. We need to do some, a little bit of weed eating, some yard work over here. But we're ready, so. Let's go back to Austin, pack up our stuff, and move back on out to San Marcos. I'm sure y'all are ready to see the woods again and the house. <laughs> mm. All right, what's new? Um, my realization, realization that that angle's really low. Oh. <gasps> what? Oh, the window. The window! And the wall! <laughs> It's finally in. So, I feel like that gives me hope that it will be done sometime. That looks good. So, this is also here. The doors close, except yeah. for one. They close. That, wait, oh. Oh. So, it's like, cool. It works really good, and then I like went to do this, and I barely talked about it. Like, come on, so close. So it closes too well. And that one closes great, and you can tell like that's what he was doing. He was like redoing this whole thing. And <gasps> what? Back they on. gave us a desk? What? <laughs> no, obviously I brought that. The fans, in my view, I don't know if you showed that. We're slowly moving things in. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, we're gonna fix all this next. Yeah, that needs to be fixed. Yeah, so that's next. Uh, this one's fine. This one closes? That one, yeah, it closes, it's okay. It's okay. That seems good to me. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> this is one that's problem. Like, you can tell there's kind of something right there. Mm-hmm. It closes, but it's just... I mean, it's just Eva's room. It'll probably be open all the time anyway. Probably be open all the time. We'll probably just close that one and leave this open. Yep. All right. You know what we should do next? Sorry. What we should do next is put this together in here. So every time they come in, there's more furniture in here. Until they get the, hopefully they get the hint. See, this one's fine. How come these don't work? I mean, literally AC has to come and just drop the, the pad in the, in the unit and that's it. And everything's already connected, obviously. And so maybe it's that new final connection because I forget. Our bedroom. So we all are right where our bed would be. Yeah. 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 Can we just put the mattress in here? No, because then people will like <laughs> they'll probably uh, lay on it while they're working.
room. This actually. Room, this room is done, I think. Well, no, it's easy. Yeah, that's nothing. It's not a big deal. It's just like little vent things. Um, which, I mean, that, that should be done like pretty quick. The, uh, apparently, the contractor and the AC guy are pretty close, and so that one is not a problem. It's the stucco is being held up by the countertop guy, which is giving us problems, and drywall, who's giving us problems. They're about to trench. Uh, there's also one thing that's new that we did not show. Uh, there's a whole line of pipe that goes to our water. I don't know if we can see that from here. Yeah. You can see yeah. that, that that's the end of it. That's as far as they got. Where? So you know how far away it is. I can't see. Do you see the, the pipe at the corner of the, uh, the the fence right there? No. There's white on the ground? You don't see the white thing on the ground? No. Right by the fence? No. Okay, now follow the fence down to the ground. Is in it the like grass. long and out? Long and skinny? It's very skinny. Right there. Okay. Yeah. So that yeah. that goes all the way to the well. But it does not make it to the house, so they need a few more. Not much. But it's already glued and everything. It's, so all they have to do is trench and then kick it in the hole and then cover it up. That's it. And then is it tied in? What do they, how do they get the water to flow? It's, I don't know this it's, stuff. It's connected to the pump. So there's a pump and they're just doing a split off of it. Oh, and so, okay. Yeah, split but is it connected now? Not yet. Definitely not yet. Um, not until they're ready. They're going to kick it in and then connect everything. Okay. See, I don't yeah, know how to get this There's going to be, there's gonna be this big day where it's all of a sudden like we kick on the electricity and, and the water. That's and then the septics already, already will be hooked up, and so we'll be good. Why we want to be here for that, right? We'll be there for that. And so, like, that day could come nearly any time. It could come in a week, it could come in a month, it could come in a year. We don't know. <laughs> we, we need the countertops to be able to do the, the final plumbing. So, <sighs> and then this crib we might not even open. We might not open it. We might because... Just, we might just do a big playroom, and then we'll just yeah. have her in our room. Just get her a little mattress on the floor until we can get her a crib. <laughs> and a bucket for her bathroom. <laughs> She'll be fine. Yeah. We are so close. We keep saying that we're so close. But we are so close. Like, painfully close. It's, it's a week's worth of work, to be honest. Mm -hmm. I like, know. It has been. Not for one person, but you know, for, for the people that are doing it. It's, in total, it's like a week's worth of work. Because literally, it's the countertops. Which includes the sink and the stovetop, and then once that's done, then all you have to do is just do a couple of fix-ups on the drywall, obviously where the fan is and stuff like that. It's all minor stuff that will take about a day. Um, and the exterior stuff doesn't matter. Stucco and the rest of the hardy and the paint that can all be done while we're living in here. So yeah, it doesn't have to be finalized. We don't have to have stucco to live in this thing. We're so close. Yeah, and of course there's other things we have to do. Like, you know, House insurance. Nah. Yeah, I mean, it's already set up. We have to say, ah, it's done. It's gonna look good when it's done. Uh, we're gonna do uh, an island off of here, I think. What? Or like one of those that you can move. So, like, if we oh, like a rolling space, one? Yeah, maybe like a rolling one. If I want more space, I can like put it in the middle or something so I can have like prep space in between. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It can't be a big one. And I'm still not exactly sure what the oven's going to be like. This, this whole area right here, I'm not sure what's going on here. I'm leaving it up to pop up. Yeah. And then we'll probably do some shelves. We're going to need them. I'm saying shelves over cabinets initially. And then we make it cabinets later. It's our stove. I, I went to... I got, I got lucky finding this one. So lucky finding this one. Yeah. There's a nest up there. Can't see it. It's right. Oh wait, yeah, you can. It's right there. I guess I have to run inside. Over here. Oh no. He's already looking at me. Oh gosh. All right, I'm gonna run away. Eee! Did you get him? No, you got away. Ready? <laughs> Go! Go! Look, Queen Beds for $200. <laughs> so.
I, we're at Ikea. We don't know what we're going to buy. We don't know what we need necessarily. So we can put any thought into it, but we're going to just go explore. And uh, it's gonna, we're, we're going to no explore. We're going to explore. <laughs> I want to buy something, but don't want to buy something. Blair wants to buy something and wants to buy something. Yeah. Right? So. Yeah. Got this little one with us. We'll see how this goes. Yeah. yeah we will. Ready, set, break. go. Well, don't break anything. <laughs> please, please, please don't tilt her over. <laughs> All right, go, go. Okay, if you've never been to Ikea, it's like a big maze, and they lead you around like a bunch of little cattle. Um, I haven't been in years. Anytime we go, it takes like an hour to get through the store. So this might be a long, a long one. I found what we need. <laughs> so one thing that we do need is like a TV stand for the living room. Um, and I like that this, are these, do these open? Oh, they're drawers. Yeah, they're drawers. Okay. See, we like drawers and things, so she Eva can't get into everything. It's a little more kid friendly. I, I kind of want a covering right here. Look. It's also this one. Okay, editing Blair here. As I'm working on this video, I'm realizing that it is getting a bit longer in length. So I'm gonna cut the vlog here and we are gonna have another video uploaded on Thursday, 3.30 Central Time. And that will show our journey back home because we are back in the RV. I know, <laughs> we said it probably wouldn't work, but we are so close to the house being done. We wanna be here for every single step to one, film it. And then two, be here as soon as we can move in, we are gonna start hauling stuff in. So we are very, very close. Matt has talked to Pablo yesterday. He was out here yesterday, talked to him today. Things should be moving along. And I think the fact that we are here helps things because he knows that we're here. And also Matt said, if you need help with anything, like I will be here. So let me know if I can help with anything to speed up the process. So there's that. Hope you enjoyed this vlog. Hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful day. Make sure to hit that thumbs up, subscribe, all of that good stuff. Links for our Teespring. Other ways to support us are in the comments and in the description box. That's it. Hope you have fun out there and we'll see you on Thursday. This is another episode of the Wonder Bill Show. The Wonder Bill Show.